Hello and welcome back to Mass Effect 2. It's time for the final adventure you may remember some time ago. Admiral Hackett came with us for a request to rescue his friend, Amanda Kenson, from Batarian custody. So we're going to go and do that right about now. But first, I'm going to figure out where in Tarnation I am. Looks like we're in the Hourglass Nebula. So we have to fly, fly, fly away. I hope I have the fuel for this. I do. Good. So. Let's fly on over to... Can I remember the name of the system? No, I can't. The Viper Nebula, and then the system is like... It's not Balak, because that's the name of the evil person. Bahak. Oh, oh, you're so close. So close. Okay, so let's go to Aratote in Bahak and rescue Kenson. Like Mount Everest inside an oven. <sighs> so, this is a quick drop in, rescue someone, drop out. I'm sure it'll all happen without incident and everything will be fine. This is me. Going it completely alone me for this one. Would make the mission more difficult if I weren't so bloody awesome, so let's see what's going on here. Or I could just press the cut power button that you have for some reason. So this... It's a rainy planet. And it's all dusty and horrible and gross. Batarians do not have good housekeeping skills, that much is clear. They can't even keep their bridges working. So let's go fix that for them. Spotted. Wow! That was some amazing shooting. Must send their prisoners down here to die. I have to find Dr. Kenson now. Yeah, it was months ago that Hackett gave us this mission. But like I say, this um, DLC is supposed to be bridging the gap between 2 and 3. They just give it to you partway through the story because... Because, I guess, they just wanted you to know it was available. It'd probably make a lot of people nervous if they didn't get the option to start the DLC before they completed the game. They might start to worry that they had been ripped off. Down. Even for a prison. A prison's known for being run down. I'd assume that prisons were actually maintained to some degree. Get your hands off me! Well... That's a problem right there. So I'm just going to go through this thick layer of dust. I bet it's all asbestos. I bet Shepard's putting herself in huge personal danger. So there we go. I've caused an explosion that presumably no one's going to pick up on. We still have to go turn the other gas valve off. Oh dear. Now everything should be fine? Yes. Let's go and explore just how fine everything is. I hear humans are scurrying like vermin out in the asteroid belt. Is anywhere safe from them? We should arm a mission to flush them all out. We should indeed, but we probably won't. What's oh, this? That's a thing that I'm never going to use, is what that is. Because this is the very last mission. I'm going to do, so there's no point, no point at all in upgrading after this is done now, is there? So, these twin jets of flame, Let's see what we've got round here, a door, to some lovely, it looks like brick, but it also looks like metal, it's metal brick. Can they even do that? What difference does it make? We can't. You've got to assume that metal brick makes no sense, really. Metal you can 
melting shit. You can make sheets of metal, for God's sake. Why would you make bricks of metal? I don't understand the world anymore. Still got it down in the prison. I just kill her. Interrogating a human's a waste of time. Let's see if I can do this stealthily. There is an achievement for getting through this entire first section without having to fight slash kill any Paterians. Something tells me that I won't achieve this because, um, well, I won't be trying that hard, basically. But it'll be fun to just give it a token go. So that's those Batarians avoided. For now. Iridium that shall never be used. A door. Oh. Yeah, something tells me I'm going to be spotted. Let's see what happens. Yeah, that's my stealth failed. Damn it. But if all witnesses are killed, surely it still counts? No, of course it doesn't. Let's see what's in here. Something, I'm sure. Uh, going the right way. This is only one way to find out. Okay. Looks like they have the same grimy doors that Project Overlord's Vulcan station did. This is true. Wow, the Batarian who walked in here just totally disappeared. Alright, so let's see what's going on here then. We have a crane. Mm. Of course, the great question of our lives now is what the hell am I doing? So that didn't do anything again. So I'm going to put it back and then we'll see what pressing this button does. Ooh. Alrighty. Um. Well, that seemed pretty exciting stuff right there. Okay, I'm bored of that. Hopefully it's not something I need to deal with. I don't remember it being something I've ever needed to properly deal with, but then why would they put it in if it was something that we didn't need to deal with? We can use this! Presumably I need to get behind here, but I don't see anything behind there. So, uh... I see, okay. Well, now I'm down here. only assume that what I'm doing is totally correct. Our call on the way intercepts paid off. We picked up a message to the Alliance coming from somewhere in the asteroid belt. We listened to the feed until we discovered an operation run by a human named Kenson. Smuggling engine parts and guidance systems into the system from Omega. We intercepted Kenson's vessel and took her and her people into custody. Interrogation has produced nothing but frenzied rambling so far. Alright then. Magically cut the power. This one's apparently the mastermind. If she doesn't talk, kill her. Take How did that kill you? You only got charged. Right. I'll ask you again. Where is your base? You're wasting time. The Reapers are coming. The Reapers are coming here. To this relay. Every moment you keep me here brings them closer. I see. If 
Fair enough then. Let's um, let's go try sort this out. Oop. I'm Commander Shepard. I'm here to get you out. Commander Shepard? I'd heard you were alive. Hackett must have received my message. We're not safe here. Can you walk? I'm fine. Just give me a moment. We have to go. Now. If we can find a console, I can hack security. Make us an escape path. Then we'll find one. Go! Ready. Lols. Alright, so, um... Now I don't know. Am I following you? Are you following me? Just both follow the arrow. This is a cell block. There should be a security console here somewhere. Yeah, that makes sense to me. Let's go through this door. Charge into that person. Shoot that guy. Can't target them. Don't kill me. Can't get a lock. You're not. That was the worst thrown grenade I've ever seen, by the way. I should just charge right into it, but still. Hey there. Didn't see you behind us. Goop. Kenson, are you still with us? I think I found your console. Let's quick save it. Can't. They know we're here. Keep them off me while I hack us a way out. Suppress the teams to cell block now. Sounds good to me. Don't see any red so far. <sighs> I see some. I can't hurt them. But I can hurt you. Or I can't. Come on, charge. I hate it when charge just randomly doesn't work. It really gets my goat. Where are you? We need to close the door we came in through. Keep them out. Alright. They're coming through that door in the back. Lock it down. I'll do what I can. Which door do you mean? This one, alright? Fuck off. Down you go then. They're coming up from below. How cheeky are they? Alright, calm down. I can do it. Hey there. My shields are down. I'm knocking all doors to the house. We need more time. That's cool, you got all the time in the world. Down you go, son. Bringing down their orbital tracking network. Sounds like Watch the other side. More enemies on the elevators! You can't just say the other side and expect me to know which side you're talking about. Ah. Bang! There's an elevator that leads up to the hangar. Found to us. Almost done. Fair enough. I'm doing fine if we're honest. Don't have much to worry about. Say goodbye to us. As can you. Kenton? That did it. Let's move. Alright then. I'll meet you there. You with me, Kenny? Oh, one last thing. The hangar doors are hard locked. We'll have to get those open the old fashioned way. Leave that to me. We 